Welcome to another Cocktail Corner. Mm-hmm. Today we're trying Man of War. Man of War. <laughs> Bill and Shakespearean. How is he? <laughs> That's what it sounds like. Oh, you come man. Out and toss your, uh, what you call it? Oh, you came and back. show your, uh, your sword. Your sword. <laughs> Cocktail may or may not be a repeat. I don't remember trying it, but Z said we might have. I so, think, I don't know. It work for y'all. Go ahead and watch some past videos. Let us know if you see it. Yes. That's the best way to do it because, you know, it's been a couple years now. We've tried a lot. Mm-hmm. So, anyhow, this one is also another sour ish cocktail because it has sweet components and it has a juice. So we're going to shake. So I am going to start with the Cointreau. Half an ounce. Still not my favorite to taste by itself. Oh, why, because it's so thin? I think so. Because you know it's a triple sec. I think Mm -hmm. you prefer cognac based, like Grand Marnier, Mm -hmm. or um, what's the other, Carousel? Yeah. I don't I think Grand Marnier, so. Grand Marnier is cognac based. Yeah. I still don't understand how people sip it by itself. Yeah. Cause it's sweet, but it's also better than sipping triple sec. So there's <laughs> that. That's true. Half an ounce of lemon juice. Half an ounce of the sweet vermouth. So you have any predictions on this cocktail? You think it's gonna be um, extra sweet or somewhat sweet, a little balanced? I think it's going to be on the sweeter side. It has a good amount of sweet components. Yeah. I'm hoping that they balance out. I'm interested to see how the orange works with the wine-based vermouth. Sure. One and a half ounces of bourbon. Could be. We do tend to like more balance. Mm-hmm. So <laughs> we shall see. And one bar spoon of rich simple syrup. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Yeah, after all that I hot water, that. I had to sit it under. <laughs> Child Z did made <laughs> an extra, extra rich simple syrup. <laughs> so rich simple syrup is supposed to be two parts sugar to one part water. When you eyeball it, you know, things happen. <laughs> That's why you're not supposed to eyeball it. <laughs> Please measure your ingredients. <laughs> yep. And then yep. life is better when you measure. Oh, let me wipe this Very up. Very true. Very true. So I usually, like if I'm making eight ounces of syrup, I tend to do like 250 grams water, 250 grams sugar. I measure in grams since it's more accurate. I did start off, you know, the one to one as measured. <laughs> and then when I took some out, I was like, okay, just add some more sugar to it. Oh, okay. I'm only starting to try to get some of the syrup off, but it's not, you know, it is what it is. So I'm going to shake it. Yeah, it's going to be good. It's going to be good. Yes, and then pull it up, pull it up, watch it all fall out. Shout out to Rihanna, who is apparently never doing music again. I don't blame her. Between Fenty and Savage Fenty, she don't need to do it. Also, though, people want some music, but every time they, I know she just went diamond for like five songs or something total. Every time somebody be like, when's your album coming out? She'd be like, shut up. <laughs> Have you seen my new line of foundation? Right, right. You don't care. 
<laughs> Anyhow, now we have Man of War. Yes. Ready for battle. All right, it's cocktail time. And we will see how this goes with the Man of War. <laughs> yes, let's <laughs> I think you get more of the wine notes mm -hmm. from the vermouth than I expected. You don't get as much oranginess from the coin troll. It's been a vermouthy week. Mm-hmm. And uh, you get some lemon juice. The bourbon's still warming up my chest. It's not as sweet as I thought it would be. Mm-hmm. Even with the overly rich. Overly rich. I mean, granted, it was only one bar spoon. And possibly a little less than one bar spoon because a good bout was still stuck on this spoon. <laughs> I go, oh, just, I was like, let me stir it in there. And then I was like, ah, it is what it is. So we might only have, you know, three quarters of a bar spoon, <laughs> to be honest. So that's okay. That's our business. Uh -huh. um, but yeah, it's more balanced. Um, well, I the bourbon see. does, you know. Still warm. Yeah. Still warm. Mm -hmm. So if you doing this with, you know, high proof, drink responsibly as always, okay? Yep. Keep it in the house. Go to sleep watching Netflix. You can chill by Netflix yourself. Netflix and chill. Mm-hmm. Or watch, you know, oh, Apple TV, right? Yeah, Amazon, whatever. Whatever you got, watch it. Yep. And have a little sippity sip. Enjoy your night. Yes. Evening. Afternoon. Exactly. True. Morning. I know. <laughs> you do you. We not judging. Yep. Though if you having this for breakfast, you should talk to somebody. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just throwing it out there. Or have a good breakfast. Uh, <laughs> a hearty <laughs> breakfast with some pancakes and sausage. You know. You something. definitely need something to soak up the liquor. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Just saying. Anyhow, y'all let us know if you try this mm -hmm. or, you know, some form. If you change the specs, let us know what specs you used. Mm -hmm. And we will catch y'all next week. Bye. Bye.